Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Good morning class Morning mom Where are you today? I'm fine, and you? I'm fine too Okay, before we start our class today Please lead the prayer, Wifta Okay mom, okay class Let's open our meeting today by reciting Basmalah together Bismillahirrahmanirrahim Okay, our material today is social mobility uh, Please, before we start our material Read the basic competence and target indicators uh, I have to share you this powerpoint on our whatsapp group And you can read later We continue the social mobility. Uh, the definition of social mobility is the transfers of social status owned by a person or group to another social status in society. The result of the transfer of social status can be higher, lower, and even remain the same. And the next is... The kinds of social mobility uh, The first is horizontal social mobility uh, The horizontal social mobility The change in social status experience by a person or group will not change their social status or will remain as equal as before For the example, a doctor who works in a Bandung hospital is required to transfer to a Jakarta hospital. In that case, the doctor experienced horizontal mobility it changing place of work, but did not change his social status as a doctor. For the second is vertical social mobility. A vertical social mobility is a transfer of social status that will not change social status. Uh, For the example, ya orang example ya, di kursi sumpah. Satu deh kak. The next is the kinds of social mobility. Uh, the first, horizontal social mobility. Horizontal social mobility is the change in social status experienced by a person or group will not change their social status or will remain as equal as before for the example a doctor who works in a Bandung hospital is required to transfer to a Jakarta hospital in that case the doctor experienced horizontal mobility it's changing place of work but didn't change the social status as a doctor The second is vertical social mobility. The, vertis, the vertical social mobility is the transfer of social status to another social status that is not equal. Uh, the next slide. The kinds of vertical social mobility. There are two kinds. The first is social climbing. Social climbing is increase in social status from lower to higher. Uh, there are some example from this social climbing. The first is sociology teacher who becomes the headmaster because he has met certain requirement. The second, a village head who is appointed region and the last is a child who was originally a rank 3 become a rank 2 for the second is social thinking uh, it's lower social status there are some example from these kinds and the first is a member of parliament who is in prison for corruption And the second, the third sociology teacher. And the last is a student who experience a decline 
in his achievement because he is lazy to study. The next slide. There is factors that supporting social mobility. The first is structural, individual, economic, and political, and the last is population. For the structural, this factor is related to a person's opportunity to occupy a position and the ease of obtaining it. In Indonesia, the community structure is very open, so your change to a cope for use high positions, such as manager and even president. And for individual, if this factor is related to the quality of the individual in terms of attitude, knowledge, and skills, human are born into the social status of their parents. Well, if a person is not satisfied with the social status, he can try to achieve a higher social status. However, um, he must be educated first in order to become a qualified, a qualified individual. For the economic, if the economic situation in social trends to be a good then social mobility can be realized. Good economic conditions make it easy for people to obtain cap capital, education, and other opportunities. But if the economic conditions are bad, people will have limited income. For the politic, this one factor is very depend on the political situation of a country. The unstable state of the country will affect its security condition. For the last is population. According to the data from Central Satisfied Agency, the population in Indonesia is almost always increasing from time to time. This increase can narrow residential areas and even increase poverty. Therefore, population problem like this encourage individuals and the government to direct people to migrate to other areas so that social mobility occur. For the next slide, it's factor that hinder social mobility. There are three. Uh, the first is poverty, second is discrimination, and the last is stereotype gender. For the first is poverty, people who experience poverty will find it difficult to achieve certain social status. One of the causes of poverty is low education. And the second is discrimination. Discrimination is differentiating treatment against other Africans of different nationalities, ethnic, race, races, religion, and groups. Uh, this kind of discriminator treatment is not very good, in addition to cause conflict. It can also hinder social mobility. And the last is stereotype gender. Differencing the characteristic and social position of men and women, such as having the view that men are higher than women can also hinder social mobility. For example, the view that women don't need to be highly educated after all is the husband who works. Such behavior can hinder a person's achievement and opportunity for mobility in order to increase his social status. For the next slide is impact of social mobility. There are two positive and negative. The first is positive impact, and there are improved social integration, speed up the rate of social change, and the last is encouraging someone to go advance. And for the negative impact, conflict occurrence. 
psychological disorder and the last is the emergence of problem in a relationship so, okay class this is all for our material any questions no okay if there is no questions i will give you assignment and the assignment is find the article about social mobility and I give you 30 minutes and after that you can present in front of class about uh, the important point from social mobility okay thank you see you wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Waalaikumsalam warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Grisela Lili Intuisya I would like to present my article My article is about Stiano Fanta Stiano Fanta, the judge of the corruption court or typical state that Stiano Fanta was found guilty in the EKTP corruption case that cost the state more than 2.3 trillion. The former chairman of the parliament and general chairman of Gulkar was sentenced to 15 years in prison, fined 500 million, and had his political rights revoked for five years. This is an example of vertical thinking. Thank you very much. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.